good guys, so um, it's Blake here. Today I am uh, back with another video. And um, I'm going to be doing a cop or drop with my father. Pretty much just a video that um, just I guess gets his opinions a little bit on different shoes. And I guess we just get to talk a little bit about different shoes. But um, I just wanted to, I guess, give you guys some announcements, talk to you guys a little bit before we get into that while my dad's getting ready and relaxing right now. So um, pretty much the major, major thing which I'm super excited about is SneakerCon Chicago. I will be playing in the rookie basketball game, the rookie hoops classic. It's the first, we're debuting it in Chicago. I'm very, very lucky to be a part of this with the SneakerCon team along with many other shoe tubers. Yeah, I'm really, really just happy to announce that uh, I'll be working with a ton of great people on this thing, and I will be playing with a ton of awesome people from across the whole country in my age group in the Rookie Hoops Classic, and it will be on June 3rd in Chicago. Chicago will be a two-day event, in case you were wondering, and uh, it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be your favorite, I guess, younger shoe tubers playing in a competitive matchup on the court and uh, yeah if you guys are there please come by please watch I'm gonna try to bring my A game um, I'm super excited I've not I haven't played a lot of these guys I wish I could have played Blake Wynn by now I wish I could tell you guys the teams and all that but they haven't uh, like given me the go to tell you guys that yet but uh, I do know that I don't think me and Blake Wynn will be on the same team just because they we, we want to sort of be on different teams both of our names are Blake, so it keeps it a little spicy. But uh, yeah, so a lot of your favorite, I guess, teenage sneaker YouTubers will be playing in this epic matchup. So that's really, really cool. I'm super excited. But then the day after, the Sunday, June 4th, is the big main event. Um, the sneaker Con, just Hoops Classic. And I did end up beating Kais in a one on one. So now I get to play in that with the big boys, so I'm super excited for that as well. I don't know what I'm going to be rocking for either game, but I'm going to try to pull out some heat. Um, Chicago, you guys are going to have a great time. There's tons of crazy things in plan, and uh, I actually get out of school the day before, so it's going to be awesome. I'm going to be focused to bring you guys the best content along with uh, bringing my A game to... Uh, the court in Chicago but um, I'm just super excited about that I really really wanted to uh, play in a game at sneaker con and now they're allowing the rookie game but I actually did just beat Kais in the one-on-one -on -one too so now I get to play in both which I'm super super blessed for so I hope you guys are there to watch me play I don't know how much I'm gonna play in the big game but I know in the rookie game I will be playing quite a bit we're trying to get my dad to coach my team because the plug, everybody loves the plug. He's got to be involved somehow. And the best way, I guess, we thought was for him to be the coach. So hopefully Alan and the Secret Con team uh, allows him to do that. If not, it's all cool. But um, yeah, I'm super excited about that. In the next couple of weeks, I guess, on the weekends, I will be, I guess, training a little bit, making my basketball skills better here and there, dribbling, shooting, running, training. And I'm going to try to vlog it for you guys because I haven't played basketball in a really long time. When I played Kais, I hadn't played basketball in a, at least two months. So if I go how I am now, I'm not going to be ready for the kids my age, the other guys my age, and then uh, the older guys. So I need to uh, somehow bring my A game, but I'm only going to be able to do that if I uh, get your guys' help and I pretty much just work my butt off for it, you know? Because I really want to do play well for you guys, but uh, it doesn't come that easy. I will be practicing tomorrow. I do have a couple pieces of merch that I'm excited to announce. First of all, in Chicago, I will be collabing with Blake Wynn, Just Win Sneakers, Just Win. It's right here, that's the collab. 
Uh, that's the t-shirt, it's super sick. Bulls inspired, obviously. So uh, I'm super excited, that's gonna be crazy. That's the shirt, very, very limited. So make sure you act fast. We will be at the same booth, it's about to be crazy. And then that's the plug shirt. You know the plug had to release something for Chicago because he wants to meet you guys, I wanna meet you guys, and he just loves meeting you guys, and he had to show some love for Chicago by releasing this limited t-shirt. This shirt is super, super limited because we wanna focus on the collab, which is the biggest uh, biggest thing I've done in a while. And uh, we wanted to do the plug too, but we didn't wanna to put too much plug. So if you want the plug shirts, you better get there early because um, they're really, really limited. But if you're still at this point on this video and you're like, bro, when are you gonna get to the video? You can skip to this time. I probably put it at the beginning, but uh, yeah, I'm almost done with my whole spiel. But um, yeah, releasing plug merch, uh, collab with Blake Wynn, t-shirts, possibly hats, possibly shorts. We're not confirmed yet, but the shirts are confirmed, which are super, super sick. And uh, to, I guess, get into the spirit of training, basketball, all that, I am having really really sick headbands made and uh as of now they're friends and family i have like a couple that i'm going to be giving to a couple of my homies i need to know if you guys would want like a very 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 limited release of uh these really sick headbands i don't have them in hand yet but they're really really sick i will be rocking them uh i will be wearing one of them at uh the hoops classic games in sneaker con chicago they are pretty sick and uh as of right now, it's only friends and family, but if you guys get this to like 5,000 likes, then I will be able to uh, possibly put some online for a very, very short amount of time, or at least until they sell out, so. But I'm playing basketball this weekend. I'm playing a ton of basketball. I'm playing against the Cool Kicks guys. I'm playing against my boy Michelangelo, Rami from Cool Kicks. I'm just doing a ton of basketball because I want to get into the mood, you know what I mean? I, I gotta start practicing, so. I'm super excited. Let's get into this copper drop video. If you watched all the way to this point, please comment down below and leave a like. And uh, let's just get into this video. So, yeah, let's do it. By the way, we are so close to 200,000 sub not subscribers, 200,000 followers on Instagram. My Instagram is right here. When I hit 200,000, I will be giving away a pair of shoes on Instagram. So, but if you guys are still wondering, like, when's the giveaway for YouTube? It's at 300k. So I've told that many times everybody who's like when are you giving it away when are you giving it away it's at 300k so I just wanted to make that clear what's good guys so we're gonna get into this right now there's an ambulance in the background pardon that right now we're basically just gonna be doing a copper drop which is basically I'm gonna be showing you shoes you tell me if you if you'd buy them which would pretty much mean wearing them and then uh if not then tell us why you don't like them I'm gonna show you a couple shoes just tell us your opinions pretty much um, I'll probably throw a little picture of the shoe up on the screen so you guys like uh, know what shoe we're talking about if you're not too familiar with the name. So I'm here with my dad, the plug. <clears throat> okay, so I guess I'll start off with uh, with this shoe. <clears throat> and then I want you to tell us what, what you think it's worth. Okay. So tell me what it is. This is a Air Jordan 4. It's all blue and it's called the M&M. <laughs> I know. I know that the M&M is a very rare shoe. Um, I like it. It's pretty cool too. I like the colors. It's got yeah. blue and black, right? Yeah. It's a beautiful shoe. It's like, like the like Undefeateds, it. but it's all blue. Yeah. I like the color better than the green Undefeateds, actually. I love the color. And I know these are very expensive. How much? You, this is on Flight Club. How uh, much I've been told that they range up to, they can range up to 20 grand, $20,000. 20? Oh, Flight Club has them for 40. Oh my God, $40,000. The reason it's gonna be so expensive is because there's probably so few, yeah. and maybe there's 10 in the world. So it's so rare that the releases, there's so few, that it's extremely hard to find one of those. Yeah, so we have this shoe right here. This is a Air Jordan 5 uh, Camo Supreme. What do you think about these? I don't like it at all. I mean, I don't like the camouflage look of shoes. I never liked that appearance. Obviously, it's gonna be very expensive because you wouldn't be showing me it otherwise. But it looks like a hodgepodge. I'm showing you different stuff. It looks like a hodgepodge of kind of different things thrown together. Um, it's just- It's like a desert camo. It looks like a clown shoe, actually, because it's got like 10 different colors, and orange and green and tan and blacks and Yellows. Yeah, these go for like around 500 bucks. Yeah, I can. Well, I couldn't tell, but they look yeah. totally hideous. 
I and there's a couple other that. colors. There's like an all white one. Well, I like that better. And then there's an all black one. God, the one you showed me was the worst color. It was <laughs> it's camouflage. It's the most popular, I guess. I don't really like the camouflage look on shoes, but maybe if you're in the military, it would be a good shoe. Okay, so what do you think about these, I guess, first of all? That's a turtle dove. Easy boost. Those are just very conventional, aren't they? Yeah. Those are just kind of cool. They um, go for about like two grand now. Do you have those? Yeah, I got a pair. Those are kind of neat. I well, I've, I've been forgetting to ask you, but okay, for the M&M's Copper Drop, you cop them or you don't? I, would, I mean, Copper Drop. Copper Drop, depending upon if you want to spend $40,000, I could never want to. I mean, that's a, that's a lot of money for a pair of shoes. I personally would drop because there's no way I'm paying okay. 40 G for shoes. What about the. Um, okay, we'll just do it from now on. Copper Drop for these. Those are cool. Cop. Cop those. The nice. Adidas. They'll cop the Turtle Dust. Turtle Dust. Adidas those are cool. Boost 350. Yeah, those are neat. What do you think about these? These are the Air Jordan 2 uh, Just Dons, the OG colorway. Yeah, you know, I don't like shoes <laughs> that look like that. It's weird looking. It's the bizarre. It looks almost like a suede type of leather. Yeah, it is. Yeah, I'm not into those at all, dude. So. I don't care. The quality on these is really nice. The cost doesn't matter. I mean, it's not for me. It's just not my look. For any price, I don't. It's called the Air Jordan 2 Retro Don. And it's a cool shoe for a younger guy. For me, it's just, it doesn't work. So I'm going to drop those. Okay, what do you think about these? The Air Jordan 1 Shattered Backboard. I've seen those. They're a cool shoe. I know you like them. The quality is really, really nice. Do you like those a lot? I don't personally like an orange shoe. It's got orange and white, and I'm not into orange, so I would drop them. I'm not into an orange shoe. What do you think about the Air Jordan 1? Oh, well, you already have I these. I have these. I think they're really neat. I like them. Air Jordan 1. Friends. I love those shoes. They're very cool. Yeah. Do I have them? Yeah, you have them. They're, those are awesome. Yeah. You got a pair at my meetup, remember? In where? Cool Kicks. Oh, yeah. The used pair, yeah. Oh, yeah? Yeah, they go for a lot, guys. Those are really good. Mine better. used? Yeah, lightly used. Oh, I didn't know. They look new. I couldn't tell they were used because they were prime, man. Yeah, they look, they're really, really nice. Yeah, they look beautiful. It is a really nice day out today. We're in Westlake Village and our home out here, and we're on the lake. We have a dock here, and it's really serene. It's really quiet, very relaxing up here. It's beautiful. Okay, so what do you think about these Air Force One? Uh, they look like galaxies. Galaxies, phone that's what they're called. Yeah, I don't like them. Yeah. I don't like any phone posit. I just hate the look. I don't like them. I, any of them, I would. they're all hideous to me. You think? It's a stupid looking shoe. It looks really dumb. It's bizarre. I, I never like a foam posit. I never like their appearance. Okay. I think they all suck, so I'm gonna drop them. Okay, so I guess we'll end it with a final shoe. Um, oh, I guess this is the good one to end on. The Air Jordan 4 Cause. I know you love this shoe, and they're in gray, right? Yeah. You love it. I think they're pretty neat. It's definitely a cool this shoe. This is like one of the best releases. And I year. think you got that for DJ yeah, DJ Kaled. Kaled. we got him. He over loves there. that shit. I got him for he not for resale. It. I got him for pretty close to retail. So keep the comments. But uh, yeah, I think that vlog. I'm it's posting very that. well liked shoe. It's all gray, easily worn. You can wear that shoe. Fun. You can wear it out. Yeah. It's not multicolored. It doesn't yeah. look stupid. So. Do you like? Would you wear them? Yeah, I'd cop that. Yeah. For sure. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, I don't know if the vlog is. It'll probably be up before this. But we got a pair for DJ Khaled. Huge shout out to the person who. Uh, Helped us get these for a little over retail. You know who you are. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I showed them a pretty cool uh, variety of shoes. If you guys enjoyed, please make sure to leave a like down below. If you want to see more Copper Drop uh, with different people, let me know. If you want to see another one with him, uh, anything else? We're heading to Chicago in exactly four weeks. We're really looking forward to being there and meeting all of our Midwest friends. And exactly YouTubers a month. And, yeah. and all the uh, sneaker guys and girls, ladies, every, all of you. So. Two thumbs up, we're out of here. We're out of here, appreciate the support guys. I'll see you in a bit, we're out of here, peace.